Okay, then, lads. Just ahead of your European Cup final against Porto next week. What we're going to try and do, we're going to try and recreate this goal. Yeah. You remember it, right? It's, it's Zan Volley. I love this goal, man. Look at that. No way. Do you know what? Do you know? Do you know why that goal so so good? So the technique's cool. crazy. It was weak foot as well. Hey, like, that's tough, you know. <laughs> Jeez, man. Challenge is mining as Newcastle. So yeah. That's the next level one, you know. <laughs> oh, oh, what a goal! What an absolute screamer! But you're my job, mate. The Zizu one's hard because it comes so like so high at the sky. I guarantee, even if you if you said to Zidane, do that, like do it now. Hundred, listen, hundred times it's difficult. If you, if you did it one time, it's hard. But my one against Newcastle was just like it was funny as well because it was just for half time. I was knackered and I see it come down like this. And you know what? I, I was going to take a touch because I, I think because I was so tired. I thought, nah, I'm just going to volley it. <laughs> and then literally, as soon as it left my foot, I thought, oh my god. Bang, it was, yeah, I just, you know, you just know. But yeah, I suppose if you, if, you, if you get one of those moments in the game on next week, in a final as well, you looking forward to it? Should be good, innit? What do you think? I think we'll win. It'd be nice, innit? It brings us, bring some success to the club, man. But I just, just for you two, just, you always train with us anyway. And I know you, even with us, you always train well. Um, you always stand out. Even all the new lads, like Jordan and that, always impress with you. I just think just stay, stay focused, stay positive, uh, believe that you can win the game. And you know, before games, especially big games, I always used to think to myself, how can I, how can I be the difference? Like, because you know the big games, you want to be that player that you know, your teammates look at you and think, you know what, yeah, he can do something special today. So I think for me, especially like, if I speak about probably what's one of the biggest games I've played. I remember when I went to the World Cup in 2010 in South Africa. And uh, the first game we played against USA, um, and I didn't play, but even then I was on a bench. I thought, you know what? If I get a chance, I'm ready because I prepared right in training. I stayed behind. I done finishing everything. And then we played against Algeria. We drew. So the first two games we drew. So we needed to win in the third game. I remember I was in the gym, and then Capello come up to me. Goes, oh, are you ready to play? Because I mentally I was so ready. I was like, yeah, I'm ready to play. And then uh, played the game. I remember that week in training. I stayed behind. I training, doing finishing. I done gym. I done everything right. So when I got up in the morning, you know, just, you, I just had a feeling, I just knew. I knew I was going to play well. Um, and we won one nil and I scored. But even when I scored and that, I was happy, I was buzzing, but it was weird though, because it's almost like, because I painted that many pictures in my head. I'm going to score, I'm going to score, I'm going to score. So when it happened, I was just so cool, yeah, I wasn't surprised, I was cool. And uh, I think that's all you've got to do, really. Just believe that you're going to win the game. You know you're going to play well. Um, obviously, help the other lads. Because uh, you two have been with us a lot, you know, the first team and stuff, help the other lads and just try and be that difference. You know, just say to yourself, right, I'm going to be the difference in the game. No matter what happens, I'm going to, I'm going to be the one that wins the game. Simple as that. I'll be watching anyone to come. Okay. That's what it is.